What up, YouTube? Yeah, that's one on one coming at you again today. And you can see we are out and about right now. We are at Chimney Top Parking Lot, Chimney Top Trails on one side, Princess Arches on the other side. We're probably going to hit both of these today since they're easy walks. Then after that, we'll probably get into something else. I'm not quite sure, but as you can see, it's not that busy today. There's a few people here and there. So it should be a good day. But here is the sign for Chimney Top. Trail 335, Chimney Top Lookout, one quarter of a mile. And if you've never been there, you need to check it out. We got some safety information here. Dangerous cliffs. This is a spot in the Red River Gorge where most people die. There's some signs down here. Uh, I think it says like a lot of people have fallen to their death, but uh, we're going to walk this trail down here and show you guys some good lookout. See here, guys, it's a nice little paved road, paved path, I should say. Got a seating spot here and there. And it's like this all the way down. Beautiful weather, too, by the way. Sun's out, barely any wind. I'm going to say it's 60 degrees or so. Absolutely spectacular day out here. But we're going to go on to, to the main attraction. All right, guys. We have reached the end. You're going to see what we came out here for. Here's a warning sign. Do not climb over railing. Many have fallen to their death. A lot of people die here. See that, guys. Check this out. Over there, you can see that's Half Moon Rock, Half Moon Arch. It's uh, quite a scramble to get to the top of it, but a lot of people do. Check this out. Because that trail goes out, and then there's a suspension bridge that comes across, and we came back. And then it's like a mile and a half, and we end up pumping down below. Yeah. And it was great because wide open. <laughs> Quiet views. Right here, guys, is where uh, a lot of people meet their demise. What they try to do is they try to scramble down and get to the, the cropping of rocks right there. And they don't make it. There's a big crack in between these rocks, and that's as far as they go. But onwards we go. Alrighty, guys, that was Chimney Top. As you can see, the views there are amazing. Quite a few people out today taking advantage of this weather. So now we're on to Princess Arch. Some people say that is the most beautiful arch in the gorge, but we're going to find out. Been a long time since I've been there, if I've ever been there. I'm trying to remember if I have or not. But I'll show you the trailhead when we get there. Here's a side little chute. If you're coming up from Chimney Top, it'll be on your right. And 
and you see it's a pretty good uh, pretty good drop here. You got some good views over here too. It's beautiful. That's half moon, I think. Half moon arch or half moon rock or whatever they call it. You got to scramble up on the left to get up there. They say it's quite challenging to get there, but uh, be well worth it in my opinion. Alrighty guys, we've made it back to the parking lot of Chimney Top. You can see there's a few more people here than there was earlier. But we're going to make our way over to the Prince's Arch Trail. Which is uh, just, it's equally short. I think it's a half mile there and a half mile back. Whereas the uh, restrooms from before, Prince's Arch is right across from it. So that's where we're going. And uh, yeah, it's going to be a good day. It's a whole lot warmer now than it was when I started. And there's going to be a lot more people, so... We'll see you there. Okay, to the other end of the parking lot, here's the Princess Arch Trail, Trail 233. It says it's a quarter of a mile. We got our normal dangerous cliff signs. Camping must be within 300 feet of the trail. So, this shouldn't be a hard trail at all. Like It's been a long time since I've been on it. I'm pretty sure it kind of looks just like this right here, all the way down. Well used. A lot of people out this track this this trail gets used quite a bit because it's close to chimney top and it, if you're going to do one you might as well do the other My fiance is in the background talking on the phone with her mother. What? But you can see how the trail is so far. I'll bring you guys back when we get to the end. Okay, here's our approach to Prince's Arch. Go left and go underneath the arch. You go right, you go on top of it. We'll go left here in a minute. But we're going to walk out here across the top. Here's the top of Princess Arch. It's hard to see the size of it from here. There's a few people out here today. It's not a very tall arch. Side view. We're gonna make our way around and look at it from down below. Yeah, that's a pretty good ways down right there. I don't think I'd wanna get too close to the edge, but let me make my way around to the side here. And I'll get you some guys some good looks at it. We're back to where the trail went to the left at the top there. So we can get a view of underneath the arch. So a lot of people out here today. Usually are here. Check it out guys. Okay, here's what she looks like when you're approaching. It's 
beautiful arch. Kind of thin. Not real big. Check it out, guys. Everybody's pretty much left. Trying to get some good footage for you people. Beautiful. Princess Arch. Okay guys, that's Princess Arch. Beautiful. Not quite sure where else I'm going to go today. May hit the, I may walk Sky Bridge in reverse. Boy, ain't that beautiful behind me, look at that. But uh, weather's too nice for me to end here and go back to the house. So I'm going to find something else to get into. Let's see where we end up at next.